Tierra de las Pampas is a new exhibit at the Santa Ana Zoo that celebrates the Argentinian grasslands. The pampas are one of the most endangered habitats in the world because of destruction for agriculture and development. Many species that live there will become extinct if not protected. The Friends of the Santa Ana Zoo are raising money for the anteater project here at the Santa Ana Zoo and it is called Tierra de los Pampas. Over five years of planning, construction, and fundraising has resulted in this exciting new million dollar exhibit. Dedication ceremonies took place in April. Local officials, zoo officials, and the public were eager to see the animals and grasslands. The new multi-species exhibit showcases anteaters, guanacos, and reyes in a two-acre setting that captivates and transports the visitor to the grasslands. You are immersed into the environment and surrounded by native plants and grasses. The zoo's exhibit provides a home for a breeding program for the new pair of giant anteaters, a threatened species. The zoo hopes to breed the pair and establish a new line of giant anteaters in the United States. The male is approximately five and a half years of age, weighing in at about 100 pounds. He's a big boy. Our female is also about five and a half years of age, almost 90 pounds. Anteaters eat a variety of foods, mainly insects. And here at the zoo, we feed them a variety of vegetables and some chow. We mix that all around and to make a nice slurpee. Anteaters do not have any teeth. Instead, they use their sticky two-foot-long tongue to lap up an average of 35,000 ants, termites, and soft grubs each day. They eat quickly, flicking their tongue to avoid being stung by angry ants. Guanacos and reyes roam the new grassland area that features native and rare botanicals from the Pampas region of South America. Guanacos, the tallest wild mammal in South America, are relatives of the llama. Reyes, large flightless birds, are similar to ostriches, but smaller. This is one of the baby reyes born this year at the zoo and now lives in the Pampas area. So come out to see the new Tierra de las Pampas. Take a train ride through the grasslands and see if you can spot the baby reya in the grass. For Around and About Orange County News, this is Linda Evenoff in Santa Ana.